Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Deck Deck, and today we're playing some more King of Retail. So, in our last episode, we got our fresh fruit and veg up and running. We went around a few of the different stores and got their income boosted a little bit. You may notice we're on 400,000 at this point. That's because I managed to get a couple of days in, and we've unlocked drinks. So, 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 so. We need to... This might be easier to do when the shop's closed again. Beverages. We've got wine, liquor, beer, soda. What can we put these on shelf-wise? Beverages, wine. Oh, hello. Now, are they all going to have the same things? Beer and soda. Right, beer and soda can go on normal shelvings. I think liquor and wine can go on something a bit fancier. That is just a shelf, right? I think we should have main body of it being black, inside of it being the nice bluey colour. That's a shelf, right? Not a fridge. I'm going to assume that's a, sh a shelf. I'm going to need a hell of a lot of these. Oh my god, this will take so long to set up. It's fine, it's fine. I think we're going to have liquor all the way down here. I could probably get liquor and wine all on one aisle, to be honest with you. You know what, I might even do that. Hmm. We could extend the toilet roll aisle. Please line up. Please line up. Please line up. Yes. And what can these hold, just out of curiosity? Don't tell me it's one bottle of each. It better not be one bottle of each. Um, tell you what. Article... Oh, yeah, I kind of meant to do that as well. Groceries, beverages, liquor. I mean, they could have one thing each. 6, 12, 18... Hold on. 6, 12, 18, 24, 31. Let me just serve a few people until uh, other staff get here. I'm actually going to shut the shop for tomorrow. Just so I can get this sorted in one episode, hopefully. Because I do a lot of messing around when it comes to setting uh, aisles up. And this shop has gotten awfully busy nowadays. So, yeah, I don't think we really want the shop to be open. Alright, my till staff's here, so I should be able to close off now. Please don't screw my cues up. So I said 31, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. We can drop six of the, the, the liquors. The liquors, even. How many wines have we got as well? Groceries, beverages, wine. 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 40. Holy Christ. I guess wine needs its own aisle. Hey, can you help me? Well, screw me then, I guess. We're going back to what I was suggesting to start with. We have one aisle for everything. It just means I'm going to have to distribute these in a bit of a weird way. Because really I only need six more of these and then we're good. We'll just have to have some doubles. By the way, one liquor's going on one of these cabinets. It's just grossly overdoing it now, isn't it? Absolutely well and truly overdoing it. For no apparent reason. Damn it! I could have at least tried to put that one in the right place. Move, dude. You could not have picked a more annoying place to stop. Was he buying through the wall then? I hoped building walls would stop that. I did get a couple of new staff here and there, by the way. Probably some till staff and some... Um, well, I don't think we needed any merchandisers, but... So which way round do these go? Have you seen how much room these take up? I think that might actually be for wine, in that sense, then. 
Well, these came aligned this way round, so... Let, let's order some stuff in. Order articles. Groceries, beverages, uh, liquor. I keep going between liqueur and liquor. It's liquor. Just say liquor. They've added some new ones in here. There's the Captain Morgan's knockoff. Um, there's the Jägermeister knockoff. Don't know what that one's meant to be. That one's Gin Bean. Oh no, that's Davy Jackson. That's Jack Daniels knockoff. Tom's? I thought I was uh, rather au fait with um, alcohol. Apparently not. Right, let's get that ordered. Apparently you can give it an order name. Uh, no, I don't want to save it. And then wines. We might as well get it all ordered in. Uh, yeah, I'm absolutely shutting the shop for tomorrow. They look almost the same. There should be an add all button. I don't think many people would use it like, apart from certain crazy people like, you know, me. But it would be nice. Just for quickly adding everything in one go. Uh, we got down to the orange flowery one. Yep, we've got some boxes to go now. If I do it this way, ordering one section at a time, I can see exactly how much um, stock there is for each one without having to actually count them all. I know I've already counted them all, but... And it should always go up in a multiple of six as well, which is always handy. I mean, we've not got all the fruit and veg. I ended up getting rid of a few of those, so I could always end up getting rid of a few of these. 57. Weird amount. And how many of these did I say there was? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, hey, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, nope, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. So we can get 50. That means we'd have to drop 7. Yeah, we've kind of not got enough till staff. Although, why have I only got one member of till staff at this point in the day? For God's sake. Let's go and get this day out of the way. This is what I mean by it's a little bit busier in here nowadays. Yeah, let's get this day out of the way and then we can just shut the shop and do it properly. Because god damn it. We've generally got four till staff, four restockers, four salespeople, four marketers in every day. Apparently that is not enough then. Or they're off sick or something like that. I don't think they paid that much attention as I was doing it yesterday. So honestly, I was watching anime while um, I was just running the days through. But it does earn a fair bit of money now. At least it started earning a fair bit of money. Not like Studly Studs or Luna's Apparel. Well, like any of my other shops. Now, but that's not what we've got a, a grocery store for. We don't expect to earn that much. Why did all of my... Oh, two of them went home, two of them went on break. So I need my restockers back. Yeah, man. I could just slap a load of shelves down and be done with it, honestly, but no. I want to use some of the newer stuff. That's why I went with these fruit and veg, which, by the way, I've upped the um, the quantities we keep of these as well. Um, the couple of episodes, well, the couple of days I did off camera, I noticed that um, we were selling out of a fair few of these. So, like I say, I've upped the quantities. Hopefully, it's going to keep the shelves from running out. The meat is sparse every day, but I've not actually seen us run out yet. Normally, by the time I get off the till, it's about half past eight. Half past ten, so I don't get much time to, um, you know, get a proper inventory. In fact, I'm the only person on tills now, so that's even worse. But yeah, we're not quite aching money at the minute. Some days we do. Some days we make absolutely loads of cash, but... It's still only a few thousand at most. Come on. It's going to take loads. I, I think I'm going to have pop and beer on normal shelving. It will look a little bit dull, but hey ho. Are we nearly there? Are people about to leave? 
Closing time. I saw you just come in. Get out. Don't act all stupid with a Q. Come on. Yeah, as you can see, a few of these run out. Well, get pretty sparse. Things like this still aren't getting lost. It's somewhat annoying. And that one right there, don't think I've not seen it. That's nice and full up there still. It's this section down here. It gets absolutely hammered, but we still got a few left, so I don't really have to up my order any. Um, that was meant to be a yes, please. Wow. Early morning. Can't click on anything, apparently. Right, I don't particularly want... Well, I could get some more till stuff, actually. I did think about it. Uh, what have we got? Only two. Oh, I've been getting loads of people asking for razors. Rufus and Ian. Ian, even. Rufus and Ian. Rufus and Ian. Where are you? Just so many names nowadays. So many names. There's Ian. We just need Rufus now. Yeah, they don't tend to want much of a pay rise. They're kind of happy where they are. It's just creeping up that bit more, but people are generally getting to the point where they're decently skilled now. Rufus is going to be last page then, right? Right there. I've not seen him on any of the other pages, so... Just creep it up one more tick there. Just don't tell my spouse. Okay, then. Secrets between you and me. Keep it chill. Persistence. This is what I mean by most of them are getting to the point where they're max skilled. A lot of them have done their training courses as well. That was them three. Restocking. I mean, there's a few of them that are still missing um, training courses, but they keep going off sick. It's a bloody nightmare to try and get them training when that many people keep phoning in sick. And I don't even know why they keep phoning in sick. It's not like, um, let's go sales speed so they can get more XP quicker. It's not like they're even being trap bad. Let's see if we can get a couple more till staff for earlier on. All right, then. We're not getting a couple of till staff out of one. Nope. That is ridiculous. Ridiculous. Yeah, no. You're going to want way too much cash. Thanks for trying, but no. Um, orders, minimum storage. That was about 600, if I remember last night. And we're going to quickly do this. Right, we're not going to head office. Nothing like that, because I kept going after every uh, in-game day yesterday. A couple of people, well... Yeah, a couple of people said that they wanted a new challenge, so I swapped them around, and the people that I swapped them with then said that they were massively underpaid. So, again, there's something happening in the head office that isn't seen, you know, properly. I've got to see. We've not got any ordering yet. Come on, my dude. There he is. We'll get this all unpacked. Which in itself is going to take somewhat of a while. We'll get this unpacked. I just want to see how that new um, shelving works. Where we're going to put the liquor. I should just say spirits, I guess. Spirits would be another way to go about it. Do you like me some Spirits. Although, no, I need to stop the drinking at the minute. It's getting a little bit excessive. Having too much. I blame the lack of smoking. I go from one thing to another. It's it's kind of terrible, not going to lie. But These shelves. I don't think I've been close to filling them out. The only time I get close to filling them out completely is when I place a big order, like I'm doing now. And it'll be a much bigger order as well once we've got our minimum storage set up for all of the drinks. Because the drinks are going to just... That's going to be a huge order. Absolutely huge. Come on, come on, come on. Nearly there. Again, if you watch the other staff do it, they are much quicker. It's like they tear through the boxes. They are ridiculous. These glasses are absolutely disgusting. One minute. 
Can't see a goddamn thing. It's alright. We've still got... He's done. Ah! No! There we go. Right. Let's go down. Let's see what this liquor looks like. Holy Christ. And yes, I'm aware that most things aren't selling, but that's fine. Groceries, beverages, liquor. You can only get two? Really? Or is it three? It's three. Hey, that actually looks pretty cool. I might do that rather than shelves of the same one. But how many liquors were they? Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-seven, thirty-one. One. I could have them like that. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. God damn it. So I could get 22. Really, I've just used shelving. That shelving. But I've made it more finicky. Let's get the wine sorted out. I need to drop 7, right? There's a lot of these diamond standard ones. Beverages, wine. Two, three, four. I'm going to drop these four. Because they're somewhat cheap. And then we're going to fill it up with these. Again, I'm doing the trick where, excuse me. Oh, I just put the same one on there. God damn it. It needs to be that one. Then the purple one takes over. So they're limited edition ones. You need to get your hands on them now. Then the red one goes there. So that's four gone already. We just need to find another three that I can get rid of. And I'm aware this is going to take absolutely ages. Apologies. It's the minimum storage that's going to take even longer though, when you think about it. Well, no, it's not because I've only got to click on one bottle at a time. We do not need hyperspeed on. There is no reason for that. 591. You know what? I'm just going to sort it now, I think. I could do that. <clears throat> because then that essentially gets rid of three. Screw it. It's going to mess up my display for the rest of it. So all the rest of it is going to be single bottles. But it'll be fine. And now these can all have an individual bay. Bit excessive, I know. By uh, boxes, I'm going to go to the other side and start from the bottom. So they can actually be laid out properly. I've got to do this for sodas and everything. I don't think sodas are going to get their own bays. They're going to have to have their own shelves. Because I think there's absolutely ridiculous amounts of soda. Mm -mm -mm. We get into the boxes of wine. 
Come on, get out of it. So boxes can start from this side. How many boxes can you get on one of these? Don't tell me it's going to be like two. Four. Is it four bottles of wine? It is four bottles of wine as well. Fair enough. Fair enough. Wine. There we go. These are actually cheaper than the bottles of wine that I was um, not wanting to sell. Well, god damn it. It'll be fine. There's only a few different things we aren't selling. It goes back to bottles now, right? Got these lovely ones with flowers on them. This is like the final step, though. Just so you're aware, once we've got this up and running, we're only going to uh, play a couple more days past that point. I, I don't actually know how I'm going to pronounce this series over. Because technically, it's the second that we finish the al well, the, the drink section. I shouldn't keep calling it the alcohol section because we do have more than just alcohol, or we will have more than just alcohol on this section. Uh, but yeah. I don't know when, when it's going to be that point where we've had enough. These look like rather fancy boxes. 591. Again, I could probably tinker with the prices, but mm, no. I, uh, I did have Jemar yesterday say that um, it seems like everything's been leading up to this point. I think my reply was a, a decent one. It, it kind of has been leading up to this point of doing a grocery store. Because my very first series of King of Retail was a grocery store, and it kind of collapsed in on itself because I wasn't sure exactly what I was doing, um, it's, it's nice to now have this full-scale grocery store that's really what I planned out for the very first series. So it's kind of come full circle with that. I mean, there's absolutely loads more things in this now than there was back when I did my first series, but... Yeah, it's, um, it's kind of cool for it to loop all the way back around like that. Gives me some uh, some nice feeling of, like, completionism. Don't even know if that's a word, but it sounded decent. We're going to have to go back to the other side for the bottles. Is there really going to be enough room for all this? I'm hoping there's some more boxes. It'd be nice to have one side full of boxes, one side full of bottles, but it doesn't seem like that's going to happen. I see some gold bottles coming up. What's that all about? Is that the really expensive stuff? Actually, we are getting to the expensive stuff. These are 887, was that per bottle? The seven six. I wonder what's the most expensive one. I think the ones that we're on right now. These look like bottles of champagne. Maybe I should have had these on the other side. With the uh, the boxes of wine. It's one thing that I've never bought a box of wine. I've seen boxes of wine. I know you just get loads in. It's like three or four bottles or something like that. But, um, I mean, I do drink wine. I'm no expert on the uh, the subject, though. Absolutely not. Hopefully, I've not naffed up the, uh, the totals of what we need. Otherwise, it's going to be rather awkward when I get to the end. Of putting all these bottles out. If I've got one more or one less than I need. Four, eight. So I'm going to need 16 of everything ordering. Because you can get four on every shelf. Four times four, anybody? 16? Yeah, I thought so. Yeah, good. I do kind of hate it that there's a three here. Is there a three? There is not a three. I'm just going to come back to the other side for a second. Because if this has end, ends up with a weird number as well, then I've screwed something. Why couldn't they do, like, nice four designs for everything? Or did they do nice four designs for everything and I've screwed it up? That seems more uh, likely. Get the golden bottles all on this side. You can't, like, just double-click these, can you? I'm not being a moron by dragging it all. 
Shift click, Alt click, Control click, no. You've literally got to drag it into the box every time. I, I just wondered if I could have been just shift clicking and popping the bottles across and instead I've been slowing myself down by like a million times by having to click and drag. Could be a quality of life thing that's introduced. Just shift click. A lot of games, you shift click to get things in and out of inventory, so why not? Oh, we started something new on the Discord, by the way. A new channel that Studley asked for yesterday morning. Because everybody keeps putting the captions on for my videos to see how it translates Dak Dak at the start of my episodes, we've now got a crazy captions channel. Just for when people are watching my videos, like I say, they can, uh, they can take their screenshots and throw them in there. Still, the best one that I've seen so far is it replaced Dak Dak with Death. I don't, I don't even know how that, that worked out. This is uh, not going to work. In fact, no, this is going to work out perfectly, isn't it? But I'm going to have three on one side, one on the other. Don't know how to feel about that. I know how to feel about that. Yes, it means I'm going to have to move everything down. Shut up a minute. That can go there. I don't know why I brought this down here, because this needs to go up at the top there. It lines it up more, and then it's not going to make it as noticeable that I've got the one bay with all the different stuff on. Really, them ones that I cut out, I could have done the same for. It's fine. We don't need to sell absolutely everything. We're selling basically everything. I think I see an empty shelf right there. Nope, that's trying to embed it in the wall. There we go. Order is resumed. <clears throat> Wine. I was about to say wine is one of the bigger sections, but I don't believe it actually is. Although it's what it's the most finicky section because I've got all these little things, these little shelving units. I could have just had one big shelving unit, put four shelves on, and had one row of each wine, and it would have covered like the same space as two of these. Again, just wanted to mix it up a little bit. Make it seem like its own section and not like I've just copy pasted the shop and made it all look identical. And yes, we're going to fill this all out as well. Wow, we're nearly on 30 minutes and I've done one aisle. Um, 16. sixteen. Wow. You know what? I'm going to do that off camera. I don't know if I like these or not. I don't know if I like them or not. You know what? I do like them. The whiskey eye is going to be completely different. I could have them alternating like that. No, let's keep them all the same way. Whiskey oil, I'm not just going to bulk it all. We're going to uh, we're going to make this one somewhat more special. So I'm saying there's 31 different whiskies. There's no way we're getting 31 whiskies down here. Actually, no. I don't think I want to do what I'm doing. We're going to have it like that. You can get two of these facing each other, right? They're just going to have to step to the side of it. I thought people were trying to get in then. That does line up, right? Yeah, yeah, it does line up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. 
11, 12, 13. So that'll be 26 we'll be able to get total. What am I doing? Groceries, beverages, liquor. That does actually stick out a little bit. If I move this down one, I can move this down two, and it doesn't stick out past the end of the wall. Some of the hitboxes on these things is a little bit janky. And then this should line up with the edge of the wall. That's better. That's more like I want it. Uh, uh, uh. It's going to make this aisle somewhat narrow as well. But they can stand to the side as well. So it isn't like the other aisles. Four, five, six, seven, eight, excuse me, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13. I guess we could have signs on the edges as well, but... Eh. See, again, you could have a backwards and front, uh, forwards here. In fact, you could have six shelves, being as though you can get either side. One, two, three, and then on the back, four, five, six. Groceries, beverages, liquor. So what was it in here? 31, and we've got 26. No, stop it. We're going to have just this one on here. I swear to God. If I'm doing duplicate ones, we'll do them at the back. It's liquor. We'll just have a few share. I'm going to keep clicking on wine now. See, aren't these all the same? Tasty Dreams 296, 296, 296, 296. I think I'm going to skip those ones. That's 13 groups of four. Because then we'll have all these at the front here. I'm just going to ignore the next two, because then that's a couple cut out. So yeah, we'll ignore these two. Because it's all, it's all the same stuff, it's just different colours. Groceries, beverages, liquor. Yeah, this one's different. And then we've only got four of these. I should just click on the top one that I'd load it out. When I say click on the top one, I mean that. And uh, that is a very brightly coloured bottle. Holy crap, you wouldn't want to go for another drink of that after you've had a few. Jesus Christ. Now, some of these are actually going to be facing backwards, technically. Don't know how much I like that, but how about we don't pay that much attention to it, and then it's not really going to be that much of a problem. Again, this is a bottle you're probably not going to want to go to after you've had a few. Look like, uh, That looks like it'd be mint flavour, and that just makes me want to throw up. Ugh. Mint flavoured drinks. Well, mint flavoured chocolate, mint flavoured anything. I'm not really much of a mint person. No, thank you. Doop, doop, doop. We'll get in there. Is there any more that's caught? I mean, you're a three there. Tooth, yes, I don't like toothpaste either, Studley. It's just disgusting. You know what? Because this is a three, 
let's swap that up there. I'm probably not going to have enough room now. This is a three as well. I don't think my uh, theory is going to work out here. Three, a three, a four. No. Two, three. Yeah, no, don't do this. Look here and go back like that. Then we want the other Captain Morgan's knockoff. And yes, I'm aware that I'm doing threes down the same side now. Look at that one as a three. And then we need to unpack all of these. Groceries, beverages, liquor. And you need to be changed to just the green Jägermeister. Knockoff Jägermeister. It's not actually Jägermeister. <clears throat> I kid you not. I know it sounds pathetic, but my wrist's hurting from laying all these goddamn shelving things out. So finicky moving the wine. Uh, the wine. What the hell? The mass, this smaller gaps, again and again. Averages liquor. And then I should have a three, a three, and a four. Obviously, that's got to be a five to finish, though, just to screw things up. So we can have a three this side. <clears throat> And then a four at the end. Well, a two and a two. Actually, how do you do a two and a two? When you've got three shelves. What the Christ. <clears throat> Please, just give me a nice amount of things. You know, I, I th I've come up with an idea how I'm going to do it. It's just a little bit janky, but it'll be fine. Uh, 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 groceries, beverages, liquor. This is the gin bean knockoff, yes? Nope, made that mistake again. It's the Daniel Jackson, or the Jack Daniels shirt. Shirt? I was going to say shirt because I'm wearing a Jack Daniels shirt. That was going to be my next point, but I've always got a Jack Daniels shirt on. I've got, like, four different ones, so, yeah. Hoop, hoop, hoop. Okay, okay. I'm going to duplicate the orange one. Liquor. And that one. That one. That one. That one. That one. Again, I'll sort the minimum storages off camera because we're on 40 minutes now. I kind of want to try and get more of it sorted. Um, let me just very quickly, I don't like this dark blue one, I'm actually going to replace that with the pink one, and I, I do like the red one, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the brown one there, pack all the articles up, load the articles, replace this again, and go like that. So that's all the liquor sorted out, right. Order, groceries, beverages, beer. This one seems a little bit nicer. So these are basically all the same, right? 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 42, 47. Really, I want to take 40 of these. I think it's 40 of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Nope. Stop already. 1, 2, 3, 4. That's one bay. 
five, seven, eight. There's only three of them, so I'm going to skip that one. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, eighteen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. This one will be twenty-eight, thirty-two. Thirty-six. Forty. And soda. Is this a similar situation? Six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, thirty, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight. Okay, then. So I need to take all the sodas. To... Why? Two, three, four, then it's five tasty dreams. I don't want it. Two, three. I like it when they come in nice groups of four. It just makes it easier to lay the shelves out. That's a nice four there. These are a five as well. One, two, three, four. See, this is going to be much quicker to load out than the others have been. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm going to go back. I'm going to get one of the... <clears throat> I can't get one of the threes. There wasn't any threes. Hmm. That screws things up a little bit. I guess if I throw that one... And was it that one in? I'm just going to have to have two bottles that have got their own base. So I'll probably have the one that looks like actual Coke. And the one that looks like actual Sprite can have their own base. Does that make sense? I know we're on 42 minutes. I want to get this finished, though, this episode. Groceries, beverages, blah, soda. Big bays. It's going to be less finicky, this one is. The most finicky bit is going to be putting the shelves down. And as you can see... That's not exactly that finicky. I, I mean putting the shelves actually in, but... Well, you guys get to see, and I, I'd do the fake air quotes if I wasn't trying to do this quickly. You guys get to see the fun bit of this. Studley, who is watching on Discord, gets to see me putting the minimum storage values all the way through. Yeah, Studley. <laughs> oh, dear. That's what you come to the streams for, right? You, you love seeing the numbers. Oh, dear. He's just like, now I'm going to go back to bed now. He's, he's not actually said that. He's typing. Don't make me send gifts. Well, if that's what you need to do, that's what you need to do. I thought that didn't line up then. I nearly cried. Don't burn me. We're nearly there, though. This is nearly the store completely set up. And you know what I say? Once the store's set up, that's it. No more changing. Okie dokie. I think we're going to have beer on this aisle. That's going to go in a four like that. And beer. We did not unpack it. Loser. Loser. I did, I did actually purchase the beer, didn't I? 
this is another thing about having the shop shut when you're trying to do this. I've not got to worry that some idiot's going to come in and buy what I'm then... Whoa, steady on there. That some idiot's going to come in and then buy what I want to get a minimum storage set up on. So the reason I wanted 40 is because really, each beer is going to have two shelves to itself. So then you've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, times 2 is 40, bam, shadaisy, there you go. That's why I wanted nice groups of 4, stop clicking on bloody that. You know, I could actually leave the episode off, well, I've shown you how I'm going to lay that one out, and it's exactly the same for the pop. Um, apart from, like I say, in the middle, we're going to have to have the, um, the two that I want to look prim and proper. They're going to have a full bay to themselves, like the full cola and the full sprite. Yeah, I think I'm actually going to leave the episode off there, rather than making it loads, loads longer by you watching me just put things on the shelf. I'm just going to force Studley to do that, and then next episode, when we come in... You're going to see some nice full shelving, and it's going to be a proper day where we're going to see just how much money this shop can take. I've got a feeling we might need some more till staff, so I'll have a quick look at that between the episodes. But yeah, that's great. That's where we're going to leave this episode. So thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to use some moral comments and feedback. Greatly appreciated, as always. And in the description below is a few links if you'd like to go take a look. The most important one being the community discord. Where, like Studley, you can come and watch me do the dead tedious stuff that I try my best not to put into the videos. Yeah, he's going to love me for this. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.